Alright, just a quick Linux video um, on this continuing problem I've been having. So I have, I've done some, you know, I'm just reload, uh, uploading the new version of Linux on the different computers, um, the Cinnamon 19, and just hoping that it would fix the problem I was running into with the, the webcams. And um, no, same problem. So you can see in the thing there, should be able to be able to read them, there are these weird whatever titled files, the S whatever it is, blah, 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 the four of them, five of them, five. You know, it was just two, you know, originally, and now it's five in the new version. Um, and it's, it's associated, it seems like, with each webcam software it decides to make these files. And one of them somewhere um, makes space disappear. I mean, I'm, you know. Uh, you might be able to read at the bottom it says 14 gigabytes. I've done nothing. Uh, you know, I might have I might have two gigabytes of data. And so you're talking maybe five gigabytes plus two. Um, and it's a 50 gigabyte hard drive. So it's obviously consumed over, you know, 30 gigabytes of the space. has just been eaten away. It's gone. And if I delete these files, uh, it still doesn't come back. I can't get the space back. Um, it's gone. For, it's just gone. <laughs> you know, it can't, can't be... Whatever file is doing it, you can't get to it. It's not. It's not in any any place I know of. Um, so it's just really strange. It doesn't matter how I delete them. I went into terminal did it this way. Did that it doesn't matter how I delete them. It just doesn't work. Uh, but anyway, the, I mean the part that's a mystery to me is it's happening on more than one computer. I'm just like this can't just be me. Uh, you know, I, I just don't know how this system can be used by a million I mean otherwise Linux is working pretty good I mean except for the fact that you can't get a more than five frames a second out of the webcam um, you know on this older computer I can see I mean this video is not going to be terrible uh, but I mean I have an i7 processor in the other computer and it's just you know the frame rate is horrible um, I mean, you know, I know it's probably dependent on some kind of video card bullshit, but I just mean it shouldn't be as bad as it is. I mean, you should be able to, I mean, Windows can do it. <laughs> you know, Windows can do better, so freaking Linux should be able to do a little better than that. But anyway, so um, the, the programs that are the greatest interest is the one called G-U-V-C-V-I-E-W. Okay, whatever that is, G-U-V-C-V-U. Um, and then there's one called um, Web Webcamoid, and then uh, Cam something, <laughs> Cam Cam something. So Cam D S O. I don't know what I did wrong there. Cam something so. Um, I mean, it's an easy to know name, but I can't can't read it. Uh, anyway, uh, that won't even run. So it doesn't even run. Uh, so I don't know. I guess you know maybe nobody uses their webcam, um, you know, on Linux. I don't know. It just seems kind of bizarre because obviously this is a serious problem. I mean, it's extremely dysfunctional. Um, on the one computer, I actually did do the time shift thing. You know, the supposed to be a duplicate of the restore function, and even that didn't fix the loss of the disk space. So. I couldn't even restore myself out of the whatever it did. Um, so yeah, I mean, obviously, I you know, I'm just wondering if somebody else can break their computer. You know, if you if you're running Linux and you can afford to screw it up royally, uh, <laughs> you know, I mean, you have a nice copy, um, uh, you know, durable. Um, just see if you can screw up your computer by loading some webcam software. Uh, cheese seems to be okay. So I don't know, I, you know, I, I should have, I, I went through the process of loading one and see if the temp files got created, you know, just to see. And I don't know, somewhere in the process I screwed up and I can't remember which program I loaded first. Uh, you know, I should have wrote it down, blah, blah, blah. Um, so I'm just not sure if Cheese creates it also. But the other programs all seem to use this, whatever these temp files are. And um, if you have more than one of the programs just loaded, I mean, not running, just on the computer, you're fucked, as far as I can tell. I, I mean, I don't even have to run the software. All I have to do is load it on the computer, and everything goes to hell. 
so um, so I can delete the pro the files when I boot up and if I delete when I boot up at least I don't lose any more drive space but if I forget to delete them as every minute ticks <laughs> I'm losing disk space um, it's it's just really a severe defect and I, I just don't know how nobody else has said a word about it nothing <laughs> I mean it's it's only me I don't get it two different versions of Linux on three different computers how can it just be me so anyway just curious if anybody's got any information at all so till the next time and uh, I think that's all I got to say like I said I most stuff is I mean Linux is I mean the, you know I first started using it it did crash a few times but it doesn't crash anymore I never get a you know doesn't freeze doesn't crash it's working in you know I can have 40 tabs open in Firefox and it's running um, you know silly you can do silly things and it's, it's pretty durable I mean every now and then you get something I mean I guess it did freeze once and I figured out I have to just hit the stupid that stupid window key <laughs> somehow that unfreezes it I don't know why uh, but anyway little glitches you know uh, yeah so that's all I guess I just you know I just want to make a video just to update on this particular subject it just seems really strange uh, and I guess this is, you know, it's really not an emergency anymore, but since I'm thinking about it, I'm saying, well, I can change the preferences in here. I mean, I can, I can switch which, you know, I can just switch the configuration files and be able to do the two channels in the same computer. So I can just use this computer for stuff that requires a camera that works. But I still have to fix this problem. But, you know, the point is, is I, I can probably get away with just having cheese and no other program. And then I'm probably safe. So as long as I don't load any other webcam software, I might be okay. Anyway, just thank you for your attention and whatnot. <laughs> yeah. Till next time.